Dear Coach, ano mo sa bigat? Isang kilong kanin o isang kilong kamote? Coach, bakit ka half naked? Well, unang-una dahil mainit at pangalawa, hindi ako half naked. Here, let me show you that. Hello and welcome back sa ating mini-series on principles of lean body composition. This is episode number 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Number 5 on macronutrient quality. In this episode, we'll discuss about macronutrient quality. What are the best types of proteins, carbohydrates, and fats, right? Because not all macronutrients are created equal. For example, uh, is one cup of candy better than one cup of vegetables? Uh, one cup of fish balls better than one cup of chicken breast. Or uh, one cup na yung taba ng tusino, yun ay iwanan. Oh my God, ang sarap nun. Is that better than one cup of avocados, right? So first off, pag-uusapan muna natin ang carbohydrates. There are three types of carbohydrates, namely sugars, starches, and dietary fiber. When you say sugar, ito yung mga pinakasimple ng carbohydrates na pag inintake mo, rekta na agad sa sistema yan, mabilis yan. That's why for some people, they get uh, blood sugar spiking, sugar high yung nagiging high, pero hindi siya myth. Totoo yan, pag kumain ka ng maraming asukal at sobrang, sobrang ganado-ganado ka. Ang kaso nga lang, kung ganado-ganado ka, bigla kang magka-crash. That's the problem with sugar. That's why you also have starches. Starches are more complex carbohydrates. Uh, pag kinain mo sila, hindi sila basa-basa masusunog ng tiyan mo, nasusustain sila. Depende na lang kung anong klaseng starches. Starches involves uh, corn, sweet potatoes, or kamote, potatoes, ano pa ba? Uh, certain vegetables and sometimes fruits are starches. And lastly, dietary fiber. Usong-uso itong carbohydrates na ito sa ating mga lolo at pa sa ating mga population na constipated. Why? Because dietary fibers, pag in-intake mo yan, hindi yan basta-basta na, na absorb na katawan, na i-imbak yan. Yung imbak na yan would allow you to push down what you've eaten pababa sa iyong bituka at papunta sa iyong yun, sa iyong umaga pagkagising mo. Alam mo na yan. <laughs> right? So, Choosing the best carbs, the the best principle that you could go is go for colors. Don't choose carbohydrates na white. Well, as much as possible, iwasan mo lang. And when I say white carbohydrates, ito yung mga simple carbohydrates. Like, as sinabi ko na nga, asukal, puting tinapay, ano pa ba, pasta. Because again, kung simple, pag kinay mo, mabilis madigest, mabilis pwede ka mag-sugar spiking, mataas ang energy mo, but most likely, you will crash. Go for carbohydrates na maraming colors. Alright? Fruits, vegetables, uh, berries, all those things. Because again, those um, multicolored carbohydrates are high in fiber, right? Na nakakatulong sa ating digestion. High in antioxidants and micronutrients. Okay? Palabanoids, all those things. And more importantly, low in carbohydrates. Right? Protein. At pag sinabi natin protein, hindi lang whey protein. This is not grow science, alright? Uh, there are 20 types of amino acids and amino acids are the basic building blocks of the body. There are 20 types na hindi ko nasasabihin dito dahil marami, okay? Let's just say for the sake of simplicity, either galing sa halaman o galing sa hayop, right? So, pag sinabi mong uh, animal proteins, of course, yung galing sa mga animals, okay ang mga ito dahil kompleto siya sa 20 amino acids. May mga amino acids na hindi kaya ang gawin ng katawan mo, calling them essential amino acids. May mga amino acids na kaya namang gawin ng katawan mo. Right? If you have uh, animal proteins, mas garantisado that you would sustain more muscle mass, you would, gain, you would gain more strength. But then again, may mga population na by choice, hindi sila kumakain ng animal proteins, vegetarians, uh, vegans. Now, if you're if you're a member of that certain population, I'm not gonna urge you to eat animal protein. What the best thing that you could do is do your research. Know the amino acids present in uh, animal animal protein. Eh, sorry, in plant protein. And paghalo-halo mo na lang, mix it up. Importante that you get all 20 amino acids for you to be able to perform optimally. Fats. Did you know that fat does not make people fat? 
<laughs> it just so happened that fat, uh, it, it has a bad name, right? Because fat, people may think, is making them fat. But really, fats are very essential. Parang yun na pag-usapan na natin that we need fats to synthesize hormones, okay? Uh, your brain needs fat. Okay? Your brain does not get fat. It needs fat for myelination and all those things. There are many types of fats, uh, namely monounsaturated fats, polyunsaturated fats, sila yung mga liquid state. Okay? Pag sinabi mo unsaturated liquid state, kahit ilagay mo dito ngayon sa table, hindi yan magiging solid. Right? Those are the good fats. Now, what are the bad fats? The bad fats are the saturated fats, right? When you say saturated, pag iniwala mo dito, magiging solid yan, magiging, magiging matgas yan. Uh, among the saturated fats, yung number one na kailangan mong iwasan is the trans fat. Pag may nabasa kang food packaging na nakalagay trans fat, ito yung mga fats na, na, hinahaya, na pinapayagan ang isang pagkain magtagal lang ng 20 years, 20 years or mahigit. Ito yung mga tipo na fats, pag kinain mo, baba rin sa puso mo, baba rin sa kaluluwa mo, iwasan mo yan pag nabasa mo trans fat, please iwasan mo yan. Again, for a meal, uh, you need 500 calories. Now you have to choose what are uh, the best types of oil you would want to consume, alright? But... With oil naman talaga, napaka-nutrient dense eh. Hindi ko isasuggest na lumakla ka ng, ng, ano, ng mantika para mabusog ka. You only need the right amount of oil para mabusog ka. Uh, what, that, what are the type of meat na pag kinonsume mo, right? Uh, pound per pound, pound per pound mababa sa calories. Uh, white meats are very good. White meats are very good dahil pound per pound mababa siya sa calories at mataas siya sa amino acid content. Now, when it comes to uh, carbohydrates, like what I said, uh, maganda na maraming kulay, fruits and vegetables. Again, these carbohydrates, they are very, you know, very, very, not fluffy. Ano sila? Uh, mabigat, mabigat sa chan. You have to do your research, you have to do your meal planning, you have to do your preparation. Kung kaya mo magluto, right, nang hindi lang ng isahan, siguro, a uh, meal for the for your breakfast, lunch and dinner following this principle you will feel in control sa yung kinakain uh, you will feel satisfied having that sense of accomplishment na nagagawa mo tong calculation na to and lastly busog ka hindi ka miserable